right, all right. All right, all right! All right, all right! What's the meaning of this? I didn't requisition any more supplies, and you're not one of Heffernan's Black Hoods. Explain yourself. We've all got seals, idiot. What are you doing up here? All right, all right.
All right, all right! Here, but how? No matter. All the non Acerin, bring me the boar spawn's blood. Beast, there is no escape. I shall return with reinforcements to finish this once and for all. What would you all right? All right, pure life. Ends here. For the shining lady. I'm certain to die without the For the shining lady.
Your life ends here. For the shining lady! For the shining lady! Bloody hell's Heffernan. What is it now? Wait. You're not Heffernan. Who are you? Oh. 
I've no love for the fell dirking beast. The swine bound me here. In life, I was Daros Dragonspear, builder of this castle. I lingered here many years, watching my last home change hands and fall to ruin. He plays the pious, kind-hearted priest, but he's trying to open a gate to the Nine Hells, the snake. I first saw Heffernan when he came down here with that Asimar, what's her name? Kalar. You know what an Asimar is? Celestial blooded, you could say. They needed divine blood to open the gates, but Kalar's wasn't strong enough to do the job. Heffernan got madder than a hornet in a helmet. He stormed off with Kalar trailing after him. When he came back, I saw him use that altar there to speak with some dark creature. The fiend spotted me. Heffernan bound me right quick. I've been trapped ever since. Rub those marks on the floor out and you'll break the spell binding me. Lend a hand. Or a boot. Get me out of this. I... I'm free. But the fugue pulls on my soul. I hear the call of my old friend Halitathlea. Thank you for bringing us back together. Listen now. In the center of the castle's main hall floor mosaic is a loose stone. If it's not been discovered, you should find something of worth beneath it. Axe high, friend. When you find Heffernan, give him a good kick in the nether regions for Daros Dragon Spear. If you insist. Hey, what be all that noise upstairs? Yeah, sounded like big fight. Oh, that makes sense. Go on past. If you insist. For the shining lady! For the shining lady! For the shining lady! <laughs>
All right, all right. All right, all right! If I understand you correctly, then, you are willing to surrender your troops and abandon Dragonspear Castle. All we have to do is give you the ball spawn. You better not be considering this offer, Delancey. We all know you're a coward. Don't be a traitor, too. You understand my position, then. I need the Child of Baal, but only for a short time. I shall return them safe, unharmed, within the week, and disperse my troops from Dragonspear Castle. I only intended to clarify the offer, Stonehand. No need for accusations. Ah, there you are. We've only just started negotiations. She wants you. She says she'll disband her army and surrender if you go with her. Sounds too good to be true, doesn't it? Listen to me. The lost souls of the Dragonspear dead need a hero. That hero is you. Join me and together we shall liberate the souls trapped in the Nine Hells. You know nothing of me, Godling. You have no idea of the compromises I've made, the people I lost to stand here today. If you did, you would not be so quick to condemn me. I told you, my lady. Boraskir Bridge was an omen. This... this... Person cannot be trusted. You cannot rely on them to do the right thing. Please. There's no need for such inflammatory language. We're all working toward the same end here. Unpalatable compromises must sometimes be made for the greater good. I... I agree with Delancey. You what? Oh, don't waggle your finger at me, Nederlock. You've got troops to spare. My militia's 50 souls strong, and I know them all by name. I know their families. Daggerford answered the call, but do any of you care about us? The hills you do. Use your brains, both of you. We can't agree to this. The reports from Baldur's Gate said someone paid for the hero's blood on a sword. Now Kalar wants the hero under her control. I don't like it. Someone in Baldur's Gate paid for the Ballspawn's blood? Why? Heffernan, what can this mean? Calm yourself, my lady. It is likely a coincidence, unrelated to our plans. Appeal to the child of Ball. Make him understand the importance of cooperation. if it'll save the troops. What Kalar plans for the hero may be worse than loss of life. 
I understand your position, Stonehand. But you must see that cooperation could end in a bigger disaster than a battle. It pains me to say it, but Nederlock is right. This time... Though I'd happily sacrifice the Ballspawn's life to end this war, we don't know what sending them off with Kalar means. Time is now our enemy. If someone else seeks the Ballspun, I cannot wait any longer for you to see the light. What will not be given freely must be taken. As you command, my lady. When next you see my banner, it will be at the head of the army that marches on you. For righteousness. For justice. So be it. Everyone back to camp. Prepare for an attack. May Time Mora favor us. Well, I sincerely hope you're worth what you just cost us. Guess it's war, whether we like it or not. Let's get you back to the camp. You're not safe here. War rarely makes sense. And it's the common folk who pay the price more often than not. To win a war, sacrifices must be made. I am gratified to hear it. You can expect me to hold you to that promise before this is done. Crusade attacks! The northern edge of the camp's aflame! Head south to the fire pit. The commanders gather there. Andrus can instruct you further. I know we've had our disagreements, but... luck to you. Find Andrus fast as you can. And take care. If you insist. Hero, we need help. When Fossey refined those explosives into the barrel of Boosh, she was left with highly unstable toxic residue. We were thinking of using it as a weapon against the Crusade, but if the fire reaches the barrels, we'll all be killed. You have to hold the Crusade off while I stabilize the barrels as best I can. They're at the camp's northern entrance. When they break through, I'll let you know. You can choose which unit to fight with against them. When the enemy's defeated, or if you're forced to retreat, talk to me again.
I'm going to stay here and ward these explosive barrels. If the Crusade reaches them, we're finished. Take a squad of soldiers and deal with those trolls. When you've dealt with the immediate threat, or if you can't defeat the trolls, return to me. Good luck to you, hero. Wizards! Damn it all. I can't leave these barrels without putting the entire camp at risk. You've got to take a squad and keep them away from here. Yes. 
My God protects me and watches us all. You need to stop those Crusaders from reaching us. Take one of the squads, leave the other here to watch my back.
The attacks are slowing. We should use the moment to finish the Crusaders off before more reinforcements arrive. If we push hard, we can rout them. The center lane is clear. Head straight north and finish off their remaining warriors. Go now and win this battle for us. All right, all right. You insist. Good work. We've still got fighting in the east and west, but the bulk of Kalar's forces have been routed. The Crusades falling back into Dragonspear. We'll never have a better chance of finishing this than we do now. Get what you need from the camp and rendezvous with the siege commanders at Dragonspear's gates.
are welcome here. Steel and magic still clash in the distance, but you have thwarted Kalar's attack upon the siege camp. The time has come for the combined forces of Waterdeep, Daggerford, and Baldur's Gate to take the battle to the Shining Lady. The walls surrounding Dragonspear's ruins teem with crusaders. Among them are Kalar's most trusted lieutenants, men and women of unparalleled skill, ready to sacrifice all for their leader. Defeating them and penetrating the castle will not be easy, but that is the task before you. <laughs> 